let's take a look at the capabilities and benefits of protocol triggers and decodes. An optional feature on our next generation Infinium EXR, MXR, and UXR series oscilloscopes. In the past, engineers viewing serial buses on their oscilloscope would have to save or print out a packet and count the bits one at a time to know what they were looking at. Thankfully, this method is a relic of the past. Keysight oscilloscopes can automatically trigger on and decode dozens of serial protocols, saving you time and reducing errors. Setup couldn't be simpler. Once you are probing the bus of interest, enter the Analyze Protocol Decode menu. Tell the oscilloscope which bus you're working with, in this case we're looking at a standard CAN signal, and then define data sources, bus speeds, and some other basic information. Then press Auto Setup. This initiates the decoding and sets a basic trigger on the beginning of every packet. In the trigger menu, we can further define exactly what data on the bus we want the oscilloscope to digitize and display. In the type dropdown, you'll see all relevant types of transmissions or packets available for that specific bus. And from there, we can define up to three fields, which are parameters of the bus as defined by its specifications. For CAN, we can define things like the packet identifier or data length code, among others, depending on the type of packet we select. In this particular setup, we've told the scope to trigger on all CAN error frames and begin a segmented memory capture, showing us 100 consecutive errors on the CAN bus. We can click through each one to see further details below in the results pane, which includes a picture of the header, payload, and a list of details. You also get the time-aligned view right below the signal itself. Finally, make sure to check out the rest of the series highlighting the new capabilities in our next generation platforms linked in the description below.